Hi everyone, so in this video I'm going to show you how to make a connector to connect multiple hoses onto one valve, so one pump. And that way you'll be able to connect multiple bags onto one vacuum pump, so for pre-brake curing. So what you will need are quick release uh, couplings, so these are the most expensive ones. So you can leave some out, but just use your creat creativity. I'm just showing you how I did uh, this piece. So you will need a few meters of vacuum hose. And then you have the uh, equal T slots um, male, so one time, and two times female, male, female. You will see later in the video why uh, this is important. You could also find on eBay a uh, manifold to distribute to five, um, different ports but i just found everything on the website of easy composites here so it was easier buying everything in one time so then you also need like the connectors but that's more for the vacuum bag and then here you see the elbow pieces uh boat times mail so um this is how the setup is so these are the quick releases why is it so good to have these quick releases on the manifold it's because you can always remove um a few of these and have them already on the back for example while while you're uh, vacuum bagging the back and then put everything into the oven and just connect them to these uh, connectors so very important is to use teflon tape around all the barbed wires so you're sure you don't have leaks into your uh, manifold because there are many gaps where you could possibly have some leaks and that's what you really want to avoid because you want to have full vacuum onto every one of these connectors. Um, so I've decided to put them into this shape just to have two upstanding uh, connectors and three that are down. So here I'm just, uh, if you move this 90 degrees to the back, you'll see what I mean. So I've had silicon hoses. Why it's so important to have the silicon hoses is because you're heat resistant. So you cannot do this with regular tubes and that's why you have silicon hoses for that. So I'm using the 12 millimeter barbed wire um, just because I like it more. It fits very well and it's very hard to remove. And like the vacuum connection to my personal opinion is better by using these instead of the eight millimeters that are a bit more loose. But if you want to remove them once in a while, it's better to have the eight millimeters and just add some tacky tape around it. So here I'm connecting the three lines. Um, I'm missing one quick fit uh, release. So I'm just, at this moment, I'm only able to use three hoses, but this will be upgraded to four hoses. Like you can see this system is modular. So if you want to add more, it's always possible. And that's the big advantage of having this system. So I'm just putting one uh, below the big advantage is that if they are not connected they will still pull full vacuum on the two other uh, hoses that you have here so this is the first bag so this part will be cured uh, i'll show in a later video how to work with pre prepreg especially their new prepreg from easy composites called xpreg uh, in the tooling form and in the component uh, component uh, form they are selling now so um here I'm able to connect the second one. And so I think it's done. Like you have your two pieces into the, the oven. You can always add a third one if you want to. Um, and then it's just closing the oven, prepare it for curing. And uh, that's it. So I hope you like this. I think if you think this was informative, just give this video a like. Uh, share it with your friends uh, if they might be interested in it. And see you guys in the next video. So thanks for watching and see you later.